The latest developments on a holiday weekend shooting in Pawtucket that killed a local boxer and injured another person. And today, the suspected gunman faced a judge. New tonight, we're learning more about his relationship to the victim and how the victim's friends are remembering his life. Eyewitness News reporter Steph Machado is live in Providence now with the latest developments. Steph. Mike and Shannon, the local boxer who was shot and killed over the weekend, had been close friends with his accused killer until recently, when police say they had a falling out. Outside Marcelino de Barros's Pawtucket home, Kayliana Hazard drops by to place a candle on the sidewalk. A lively spirit. He was always the life of the party, the life of everything. Another friend who didn't want her face shown says she stopped by every day since de Barros was killed on Saturday. I would want everybody to know he was really nice. He was so sweet. He was a really good guy. Police say the 20-year-old was shot in the face and the back early Saturday by 21-year-old Cedric DeLumba. The alleged killer was his roommate at the Beechwood Avenue home until a recent falling out sent him packing. According to a court affidavit, another roommate told police the suspect was best friends with Mr. DeBarros, and he, the suspect, knows they have money. They were really close. They were definitely close friends, well, kind of like family, so... It was shocking. DeLumba has been charged with first degree murder and felony assault for also shooting Jalen Braxton, who survived. DeLumba ordered to be held without bail at his arraignment Monday morning. Hazard says she and DeBarros met at Tolman High School, where they were both in ROTC. Friends say DeBarros was a successful amateur boxer and a mentor to kids. He lost his father earlier this month. And we'll tell you more about Marcelino DeBarros' boxing career and what his coach said he had planned for his future. Coming up new at 6. Live in Providence, I'm Steph Machado, Eyewitness News. But first at 6, we're learning about the local boxer shot and killed over the weekend in Pawtucket. And as we reported on Eyewitness News Live at 5, police say Marcelino DeBarros was gunned down by his former roommate and best friend, Cedric DeLumba. Now, this happened this morning when he faced the judge. Eyewitness News reporter Steph Machado spoke to those who knew the victim, and she joins us now live with the new details. Steph? Marcelino DeBarros was known for his skills in the boxing ring. His fellow athletes, just some of the many people mourning his loss after police say he was murdered over the weekend. Three pairs of boxing gloves draped over the fence and placed on the sidewalk in front of Marcelino DeBarros' Pawtucket home. The 20-year-old Tolman High School graduate, a successful amateur boxer. His friend Kayliana Hazard stopping by. Boxing was his life. He always told me he was going to teach me. I never really went into it, but I'm waiting for my lesson one day. I'll definitely get that from him. In this gym, everybody's friends with each other, and we all like family, like a big family. DeBarros' his boxing coach, Roland Estrada, says he won three golden gloves consecutively in the past three years, two novice titles in Fall River, and then an open title this year at the New England Golden Gloves in Lowell. He recently told his coach he wanted to go professional. Those dreams shattered when police say DeBarros' his former friend and roommate, Cedric DeLumba, shot and killed him early Saturday Saturday morning in the back and the face. Police say DeLumba had just moved out of the Beechwood Avenue apartment after a falling out. They were friends, um, really close friends. I would have never thought that he would do this to him. And DeLumba was arraigned this morning here at Providence District Court for first degree murder. He's also charged with shooting another roommate in that same confrontation. That second man survived. DeLumba is being held without bail. Live in Providence, I'm Steph Machado, Eyewitness News.